Right guys, we're going to talk about Jordan Spieth's putting from short distance. Because it's quite an unusual way of holding putts from a short distance. It's obviously worked very well for him. Masters winner. And I'm sure he will win many more tournaments to come. 21 year old and he's doing incredibly well. But his short putting style is quite unique. I don't know if you noticed it when you see him on, on tour, on TV. Is that on a short putt, he actually looks at the hole. So he's looking at the hole when he's making his stroke. And it got me thinking, I mean, is that, is it a good way of putting? So I wanted to try it, I wanted to talk through it, I wanted to give it a go on camera and also talk about the benefits of it, but also maybe a bit of the downsides of it as well. So it, he normally does it on quite a short range, so three to four foot. I wouldn't particularly do it on anything longer because I think that gets a bit harder. And I would say doing this on breaking putts would be more difficult. So I think straight putts, those short range where you want to hit it firm and in the middle of the cup would be best. The reason why I think on breaking putts it would be harder is would you be looking at the hole or would you be looking at the line that the break would go on? So I'm not sure about that. I only noticed Jordan doing it on very short putts, very shortish putts. Uh, style anyway is quite quite unique to himself as well. So he holds left hand below right for a right in the golf, but his hands are incredibly close together. They're almost level. They're almost level together. He then sets up and gets the forward shaft lean. So before he hits, he gets that shaft leaning forward, but he's looking at the hole as he makes the stroke. So I'm gonna lean the shaft forward, look at the hole and make the stroke. Seem to work. Now the advantage with that, is that you're more focused on your target rather than your stroke. So on short puts like this, I know a lot of players will get very, you know, into what their stroke is doing and forget where the target is. And we came to think about it in other sports. Imagine other sports. So if you were throwing a ball somewhere, if you were throwing at a target, you are looking at the target. You're not particularly looking at the ball and you wouldn't be looking at your arm. You won't be looking at your, your ball and you won't be looking at your arm as you throw. You'd be looking at the target as you throw at that target. So I, I kind of understand that. And then in other sports, in, in shooting, in archery, you're looking at the target. You're not always looking at the actual ball or the mechanics of your golf swing, the mechanics of the movement. So I quite like that. You become more instinctive to actually aiming at your target. So left hand below right, hands incredibly close together leans the shaft forward, looks at the hole, and miss. But I think that's the thing that felt for me, I lost, you know, there's a little bit of, of trust behind that. I feel like I can't trust what I'm doing back here. I think with time and practice, I think that could be, I think that could be a trust that you would start to develop with this motion. And again, I don't believe that you know, it's for long puts, and I don't think it's for breaking puts, because for a breaking put, let's say you're breaking to the left, you'd be looking at a point that's to the left, and that goes away again from maybe our target-related activities that we're trying to do with this shot. So keeping the target in line, hand below right, left hand below right, hands really close together. He leans that shaft forward quite aggressively. He's looking at the hole and he rocks it in. And I think, for me, I feel less nervous doing that. I feel I'm looking at target. I'm just picking a point in this cup. I don't know if this third ball will fit in there, actually, let's see. Oh, it will. I'm looking at target. I'm looking at a, a real, the, the place where I want to put that ball, and I'm making it very small. I'm looking in the cup there, not just looking at the cup in general. I'm looking at the very smallest part of the back of that cup when I make that put. Do your lining up first, make sure you've got all your lines and you know where you're aiming and maybe even line the ball up on the, on the, line the line up on the golf ball before you do this stroke so you know exactly where you're aiming. I think it's a lot of strength in that. I think a lot of players may be doing that, weekend golfers as well, to help shorter putts on straight three, four, five foot putts, looking at the hole, relating back to your target and forgetting the mechanics of your stroke. I'm certainly going to be trying it, so guys, stay tuned for the course logs for that. Thanks for watching, John Spieth, Under Armour guy, doing great, keep it up and I look forward to seeing, hearing your stories, whether you've tried this technique and whether it works for your short putts. Thanks for watching guys, we'll see you soon.